Welcome back. We have Jordan Papadennis joining us from the Kamloops Heritage Railway, where he works as the manager. And it's great to have you here. Thank you. It's good yeah. to be back. I feel like I was just here. <laughs> I feel like you were just here, too. That means you had a busy summer. And we were just talking about this on the break. You guys had a record-breaking summer for numbers. We had a really, really strong summer on the train. So the train holds 210 people on our regular consist that we take out in the summer. Our average guest count was about 171 per train yes. and we had a lot of international visitors so a lot of people from out of country and a lot of people from well not international but a lot of people as well from other provinces and I credit that to Tourism Camelots and all of our advertising that we've been doing. Good a really you. strong summer. Good for you. And that's despite the fact that we did get smoked in for a couple of weeks. You guys had to cancel two runs. We only canceled two, which yeah. Which is fantastic that yeah. you were able to pull through. We pushed through with the Sip and Steam wine train, which was that weekend. We had a great beer and blues cruise. Fantastic fireworks special at the beginning, which even though it was rained out on, but it was all good. I'm glad to hear yeah. that. And so as we head into fall, uh, certainly it's feeling like fall outside right now. Uh, there's a lot of events coming up. Yes, yes. So first off, first event coming up is actually still in September. So September 29th is the Harvest High Tea. And we've been doing that for six years now. Um, there's a picture there inside our cafe lounge car. It's a static event and it acts as a fundraiser for us. Okay. As the community knows, we are a nonprofit. Um, everybody that's there is, is mostly volunteers. Um, so this has been going on for six years and we welcome people to come into our 1954 cafe lounge car, sit down, have a scone service, have some, some goodies, some cakes, some teas, and just to have that kind of first class experience in, in the fall in the cafe lounge. Beautiful. Yeah. All right. And then that moves into the ghost train. The ghost train. Ugh, a classic. Here it is in, a classic. In, in Kamloops, yes. And this year we've, we've changed it up just a little bit you know, just to keep it fresh. It's still the classic ghost train with, you know, the bride and groom going out, um, the headless horseman. Everybody loves a headless horseman. But this year on the train, we're adding a medical car. And the story of the train is that in 1918, the train was destined for hope. Get it? Hope. Mm -hmm. We never reach hope. Um, mm -hmm. And we were supposed to drop this medical car off at Tronquille Sanatorium. And of course, we never get there. So we've got this first <laughs> class car on the train with all these first class people. And attached to their train is this medical car. And you can just imagine what's going to happen on board. That is awesome. This train. Is this for kids or is this for adults? This one is for, for families. Okay. We just um, recommend that if little ones are coming, you know, have the parents with them. Yes. Um, you know, let them know that this is all theater. It's all fun, even though it is scary. This year, we are stepping it up a notch with the ghost train. It's going to be quite scary mm. with the whole story of the train. 1918 getting lost and coming back with all the dead on board it's it's going to be terrifying we hear the thunder there and i'm like oh yeah it's going to be terrifying <laughs> that's last year tourism counts put that together for that us that is awesome yeah that is a lot of fun yeah. so uh, for families that like to be adventurous and have fun on halloween that's something to check yeah, out for yeah. sure yeah there's a great photo of the the ghost train in all her glory yeah, out there there's from years past some mm -hmm. of our ghost onboard attendants of course, everybody on the train is, has been lost since 1918, and on the night of the ghost train, we all come back. We all come back. We try to get to, uh, to our destination, but of course, never make it. Um, some more pictures just going into them here. Trick-or-treat train. Look at this cute little guy. Mm -hmm. So the trick-or-treat train is happening twice this October, Sunday the 21st and Sunday, Sunday the 28th. Okay. And on that train, this is more geared towards those little ones. Mm -hmm. This is the one where you... Bring out your little one, let them dress up. We have goodies on board. We set out in the daytime, so we leave at three in the afternoon. We go out to the CN Junction, so our regular excursion. But on the way back, we stop at St. Joseph's Roman Catholic Church. I don't know if you've been on the train, but on, on the route, there's a historic church. Mm -hmm. And at that church, we let everybody off the train. And surrounding the church is a whole bunch of pumpkins. So everybody gets off, they go around, they can pick their pumpkin, they grab the one they want, they jump back on board the train, we bring them back into town. Fun. So you're home. By about 4.30, 5 mm -hmm. o'clock, just mm -hmm. in time to carve the pumpkin. It's so, so fun. Yeah. You guys have some great events. Yeah. Uh, so tell me this, we're just about out of time, but camrail.com for booking these tickets and probably a good idea to book them sooner than later. Absolutely, yeah. So we, we just put Ghost Train on sale on Monday and already some of the trains have about 50 passengers. Okay. So yeah, yeah. It's, it's selling Quick. fast. Yeah. Um, so camrail.com is the website for Trick or Treat Train and Ghost Train you can book on there. Okay. For Harvest High Tea, give us a call. Okay, and yeah. of course that number is 372-2141. 374-2141. 374-2141. Yeah. Awesome. And then just to let the commun community know as well, I'll be back on with you probably. Yes. Um, but Spirit of Christmas will be nice. going on sale as well soon. And we've added a few more trips for, for Christmas time. So we're going to have 10 excursions going awesome. on. Awesome. Good. Yeah. Good for you. Sounds like a lot of fun stuff going on. It always is fun. It is fun. <laughs> All right. Thank you so much for being here. Camrail.com. And then phone if you're looking for Harvest IT, 374-2141. Quick break. We'll be right back.